Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls 2. It's time for the Crown of the Sunken King. This is the first part of a three-part trilogy of DLCs. So you access the first part by going into the Black Gulch, and then coming into the room where you fight... Uh, what's his name? I think it's the Rotten. Whatever that huge putrescent blob made of people. Whatever the hell that thing was called. Yep, you go into here, and you go back here. And uh, after you get the DLC, by the way, you get a key. Right here, the Dragon Talon guides one to an unknown land. And that is what gains you entrance. To here. It is magnificent looking. Look at it. Beautiful. Return to the far fire. Okay, so that's a one-way bonfire. Visions of gorgeous view. I'm pretty sure the entire DLC is set underground, isn't it? Not sure how gorgeous it'll be. Then again, I've seen some gorgeous underground views in the Dark Souls series. Secret ahead. Beggar, therefore despair. I have no idea what that means. By the way, I have not played this game at all since I finished it, which was, what, one, two months ago? It wasn't that long ago, but I haven't played it a single time, so I am going to be rusty. I'm definitely going to be rusty. Let's go. That is a gorgeous view, actually. Look at this chamber. Beautiful. Now the real fight begins. Yeah, I have not heard anything about this DLC, by the way, other than... I've heard a couple people saying it's... It's very difficult. Like, it's even better than the main game. Which I'm hoping is true, because honestly, most of the bosses in the main game were just too easy. Whoa, the sign written here is being channeled from somewhere far away. I wonder what that means. Strange. Beggar but charging. Destroy but- oh, of course. <laughs> it wouldn't be Dark Souls without lewd things written on the ground. Are these like pressure plates? They look like they could be. Be wary of Merchant Weakness Fire. Eh, might as well light a torch. I've got an hour and 11 minutes left of these. By the way, I have taken the liberty of going through my inventory, which was becoming extraordinarily cluttered. I literally, I literally kept every single item I collected over the entire game in my inventory. Which led to me, you know, like when I picked up a new weapon, I would have to scroll through pages and pages and pages of weapons. And oftentimes I would just say, you know what, I give up because I just couldn't find it. So I actually put all of my items that I don't use in my uh, my item box at the bonfire, the far fire. So I've only got the stuff I use or the stuff I think I might use. It's much, much less cluttered. So if I pick something up, I'm probably actually going to be able to find it. Hooray! Key required ahead, but try money bags. Oh, is that the key, the uh, dragon thing? I like that slow opening, it's epic. Yes. What's inside? Did I actually use my key? Didn't seem like it. Maybe it's further up. Are you ready? You ready for this? Oh yeah, I'm ready for this. What do you bet I'm gonna die to the very first enemy? Let's see. I know how to attack. I remember how to dodge. Okay, I think I'll be okay. I love this underground, like, destroyed ruins. It's very cool. Wonderful environmental design. I wonder what my first enemy's gonna be. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? I've never been down here. This is the first time I've ever set, set my eyes upon these stones. Whoa. Shh. 
Shulva Sanctum City. Look at that. Holy crap. Also, I can't ignore the fact that I hear a very deep breathing sound. As if there's a very large entity nearby. Where is that breathing noise go? Oh! It's either sleeping or it's sickly. Hello? Whoa! Felt my controller rumble with that one. Please don't burn my face. You're gonna burn my face, aren't you? Oh, what do you bet that's foreshadowing? I'm probably gonna have to fight that. Yeah, I think it's foreshadowing. Let's take a bet. What do you bet? All these people died to falling off. Mm-hmm. And this one? Oh, you actually didn't. What the hell fought you from back here? There's no one here. Hmm. Strange. They worry of boss or try attacking. If I actually attacked it, would have would it have attacked me? One must wonder. But one is also glad that one did not try that. One is also going to stop talking in third person. I did it, and then I did it. Congratulations for doing it. Hurrah for magic. Boo. I hate magic. Especially in PvP. Sorcery. Yes, that, that is a word. That is a thing. So is bread and milk and car. Old growth balm. I wonder what that does. Unfortunately, I didn't clear out my consumables because I, well, might actually consume them. Old growth by... Uh, I give up. <laughs> I don't want to search for it. God, look at that. Whoa, what the hell is that down there? It looked like dinosaurs. Like tadpole dinosaurs. Okay, there's a doorway there. What's over here? My first enemy? My first enemy! Okay, let's see if I can defeat him. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I'm kind of surprised given how small he is that my first hit didn't actually get through his poise. Didn't seem to stun him. Whoa. Glowy things. Also weird noise up there. Okay, this seems like it's where I'm... Oh, what the fuck was that? It seems like where I'm supposed to go. Which makes me curious. What is down here? Hmm. This room could have as many secrets. Don't think I want to PvP anybody right now. Damn, that's some nice armor. Whew, I don't think I want to fall down there either. There could be a lift at the bottom of it, I suppose, that uh, maybe lifts you up. This is probably some sort of a shortcut. Oh, 
Damn. Oh. No, you don't. Only I drink the Estus here. I am the one who drinks. Sniper spot. You told me a little bit too late. Fuck you. I don't need no shield, I just dodge. Ow. Ow. Okay, that one stunned him. I gotta get the range just right on this halberd again. It's something I've always had trouble with doing. Coming up a little bit too short. Or just getting a little bit too close. Ow. Mother fucking piece of shit. Almost had me there. Whoa, that thing just turned. What? Did I hit it? Oh, what the hell? Okay, I'm definitely rusty. No doubt about that. Okay, did I just hit this to activate it? Okay. Simple talk, simple toggle switch. Probably no point in me actually standing up here. I suppose. I guess I could go on the top of it, which would probably allow me to do absolutely nothing, but I want to try it anyway. It's times like these that I wish I had a shield. Oh, I thought I was about to die. Oh god, where the hell am I now? Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if I can push you off. Well, I could if you were closer the edge, that is. Where the hell did you come from? There we go. That's better. Alright, so I have to get on that as it's coming up if I want to get the special item. <sighs> These guys are definitely pretty tough. I don't think it's just that I'm rusty. That certainly doesn't help. But it's actually surprisingly hard to stun them. If I went down there, could I even get back up? Hmm. Longbow plus seven. Holy shit. Plus seven weapon? Hold on. Anyone going to shoot me? No, it looks safe. Plus seven. That's really nice. Probably better than my lightning short bow. Oh, there you are. Hello. Oh, can't you do like a thing where you fall through the sky and like hurt someone while doing so? That's not how you do it. Uh, that is especially not how you do it. <clears throat> well, I guess we're going back to Majula to repair my life ring. Wait. 
Wait a minute. Did I have my life ring equipped? Or the... Not the life ring, but the one that protects my life. I guess I didn't. Actually, because my souls are gone. Shit. I should have had that equipped. Let's go ahead and put it on. If I can remember what it's called. Ring of Life Protection. Okay, that's it. Well, I can still get my souls back. I believe I have a ring that decreases enemy poise as well, which might help me un uh, might help me stun them. I'm having some trouble with that. Okay, I think the rust is coming off of my fingers. The WD-40 is starting to do its thing. That? Oh wow, it actually killed a bunch of them. <laughs> I just wanted some cover from the arrows. Hello? Yeah, these are interesting mechanisms. There's a lot of stuff you could do with them. Right on top. Go down, use them as elevators, use them as cover, use them for enemies. Let's ride this one down. Let's see where it goes. Wait a minute. Oh, there's an item up there. I missed it. I also could have gone gotten off there. Wait a minute. I'm not stuck here, am I? I feel like I might be stuck here. I can't take this. Um... I'm trapped down here, aren't I? Fuck. I'm trapped here. I think now is the time to use that item. That teleports me to my, to my last bonfire. If I can find the damn thing, I think it's this. Yeah, here we go. Well, it's been like a half hour, and so far I've made barely any progress whatsoever. Wait, you respawned? What the hell? Well, shit, if you respawn, I guess I'll just get my Estus flasks back. That was my finest shot yet. See if that ruins their day. Because they are resting on it. Nope, didn't do a thing. Oh, 
Holy shit. Flattened my face. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I'm doing terrible. Can you imagine how I'm going to do on the bosses? This almost makes me want to use a shield, but I went through the entire game without using a shield. I'm certainly not going to change now. Nope. Back to Majula. To the jeweler, which is actually the armor smith, strangely enough. I've got like 10 feet in the freaking place. Oh my god. I'll be around if you make it back. You know, I'm actually... Here's what I'm going to do. Let me grind some souls up in my coffee grinder. You would. And let's go ahead and repair this, the Ring of Soul Protection, because the Ring of Soul Protection is just like the Ring of Life Protection. Except it's a little more comprehensive in what it protects. But they serve the same function. It's a little more expensive to repair in terms of souls, but it still doesn't cost much. And that will allow me to basically die two times without having to get, uh, die one time without having to go get repairs. Because now I've got two rings that protect me. It'll be worth it. Save some time. I'm really not worried about leveling up or saving my souls for anything. Okay. Oh, sweet. Knocked him off. Cool. Hmm. I guess you could shoot some of these things with arrows if you wanted to. Take out one or two. There we go. Killed one. Almost killed the other. Let's actually stay back here and let's get this guy. Come on. Come off your throne. Come off it, man. Yeah, it seems like if I hit them twice, that I guess it decreases their poise enough to stun them. But just once doesn't seem to do it. More old growth bomb. Alright, what's this item that I missed? Oh, just a bunch of life gems. <laughs> Who needs life gems? Oh, almost walked off the edge. Um, hmm. I could just jump down there. Or I could just ride this down there. Let's try that again. Ah, oh, I missed it. Wait, this doesn't just lead me back to the area where you can't go anywhere, does it? I didn't did I, did I just do this again? 
Motherfucker! God damn fucking shit. Bull crap. I'm never gonna finish this DLC. I'm never gonna finish this DLC. This guy better not have respawned. Fuck you, I don't care. Fuck all y'all. Don't care? Don't care about your shit. Fuck you. Ow. I do care about that. I hear like a skittering noise behind me. I don't like that. Okay. Yeah, what the fuck is that noise? Well, I can still get my souls back? Surprised about that. Hello? Poison stone. That's another consumable I'll never, never find in my endless abyss of a consumable inventory. That just opened me up to taking more shots. Let's continue on. That skittering makes me think spiders. Those eggs make me think spiders. Shortcut ahead left, oh shit. I don't like this room. I don't like those things. Oh god. Look at all the spiders. They're everywhere. <gasps> I'm so glad I'm not arachnophobic. Golden fruit bomb. Lots of bombs. God damn it. Can't even fucking look outside the doorway without getting shot in the face. Yeah, this place is a maze. Okay, what's that doing? Is there something down here? Oh, there is. Oh, there's a shield break skill. What is it? Ah. Uh. I'm such a pro. There's a shield break skill. What is it? That's what it is. That's right. Might be useful on that guy. Alright, <laughs> swap out this ring for the other one. <sighs> I'm gonna kill them because they keep shooting arrows at me. Oh, that stays there. Oh, never mind. I can just go this way, then. Hi. Oh. No, you don't. Thankfully, they're extremely slow in drinking their Estus. Guess they've got an adaptability of, like, two. Oh, this is just a secret area. 
Poison bite ring, plus one. Oh, shit. Poison bite. Oh, increases poison resistance. Okay. Trying not to disturb the eggs. I think I'm gonna have to, though. Yep. Very glad I have so much stamina. Be wary of ambush. Yeah, I guess I should kill that guy, huh? Otherwise, he's gonna shoot arrows at my back. <laughs> That's so cool, the way the environment shifts all the time. Oh, that was the stabbing motion thing. It didn't... Did, oh my fucking god! Can we just, like, ban holes? I, I wanna ban holes. Just ban them. Make them illegal. Ten years in prison? Maybe? Anything to deter, to deter people from making holes. Just no more holes, please. Fucking holes. Damn, I actually got a lot of souls. I... I'll be around if you make it back. I actually almost want to try my ring. In fact, I am going to try my ring. That does... Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, additional reduction of enemy poise. Let's try that. Because if I can stun them in one hit, that's going to make it a lot easier. On the other hand, if I can't, it's completely useless. I think that's a no. Let's try it again. Hmm. Well, let me try it on someone who's not waking up. Gauntlet. Hmm. Ah, they're pretty light armor. Yeah, too light for me. Alright, what about you? Come on. Nope, didn't work. I've tried this ring once before near the end of the original game and it 
also did not help me then. It seems to be pretty much useless. What was it? Ring of Life? The Ring of Life. There's nothing up there. Let's just avoid that room altogether. No, I was going to jump, but you know what? I'm done falling down holes. That is not where I meant to jump. Oh, <laughs> the guy jumped down anyway. I've got a nice lineup of people to kill. Too many, in fact. Hmm. What's over here? Those fucking noises are terrifying. Eh, let's see what's over here. Be wary of bug above. Is it a big juicy one? Hello. Oh god, is that that armor ruining stuff? It probably is. want none of your orange drink, your orange powder. Yeah, how's my equipment doing? Yeah, it's definitely a little bit damaged. But it's okay. Elizabeth mushroom. Oh, those are very valuable. Never used one, ever. But I suspect they'd be good for long boss battles. That's all that's here, isn't it? Yep. Alright. Sniper spot. Elizabeth mushroom. Looks like that's it. Oh, right. I need to go up there to get back. to get that item. Don't know how, though. Oh, God. Not these fucking things. I hate you. 
I actually wish I kept a trash weapon just for destroying these things, because this is going to eat up a lot of my durability on my weapon, which is already quite low. Oh, shit. Oh! Hi. The f how? How do I attack you? Aside from what's on its back, it's actually a strangely cute creature. Maybe I don't attack it. Hi. There's so many ways to go. It's overwhelming. I could go down, I could go forwards, I can go up. But which way is the right way? Is there a right way? Maybe they're all wrong ways. Oh my god. Okay. Well, it's fine. That's fine. That's a nice hole. It's a good hole. Any hole that doesn't kill you is a good hole. He just... <laughs> he just fell off. Smart one there, buddy. See, that seems like that's where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, so let's go everywhere else. Let's go back up here, but this time let's not fall down a hole. Dried root. Hmm. Hmm. It's a lot of things in here. Wait, wait, I saw dried something. Oh, there's dried fingers. I wish you could sort by... There it is. I wish you could sort by newest. Restores HP for a long period. Hmm. Sounds similar to the Elizabeth mushroom. Yeah, large gradual restoration of HP. Root of a perennial herb native to the south. Restores HP for an extended duration. Wild animals abhor the pungent odor of this root, but clerics on pilgrimage are keenly aware of the value of its powerful medicinal effects. Ooh, that gives me access to a ledge. Hmm. Alright, let's kill the guy that's shooting me. Alright. Whoa, there's two of them. Oh, I wonder if he's a bow guy.
Yeah, my weapon is about to break. I need another bonfire right about now. Hurrah for shield, indeed, that is exactly what I use this for. Something's vomiting acid. Oh god. It's a ladder, isn't it? I hate you. Whew. Oh, there's a bonfire. Look at it. You see it on the very right side of the screen? Do I have repair powder? God, what does it even look like? I have too many things in my inventory. Uh, isn't it like a pouch? I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna have to use it. Alright, so if I lift, lift up all these things, it'll allow me- oh, It'll allow me to get to the bonfire, right there! Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Don't you shoot me, you son of a bitch. Eh, okay. I can take one shot. Okay, um, hmm. How's this gonna work? So those two are over there. How do I, hmm. Hmm, hmm. Might need, need to use a bow and arrow. The problem is I don't remember how to aim it manually. Someone told me, but I forgot. So there's... That body's moving. So I need to raise up four of them. <laughs> it's like his body's saying, uh-uh, no, no, no. that, or maybe he's just got an itch on his forehead. You never know. Dead people have itches, too. I think the fourth one's up there, yeah. So there's one here, there's two there, and then there's one up there, behind my head. Um, how do I get them all? Let's just start hitting stuff. Shit. Oh, oh my, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Jesus. And we do it all over again. Okay, before I quit for this session, I am gonna get to that goddamn bonfire. If it's the last thing I do. coming for me? Yep. Good aim there, buddy. If you just aim to the side by about four feet, you might have gotten me. Come on. 
How the hell did that hit me? Let's uh, not get shot in the back. He's just going away. Oh, okay, bye. Well, he's just having a temper tantrum. All right, it stays lifted up. Jesus. Oh god, oh god. One more hit and I think I'm dead. Freaking arrows. Come here. My cover was not very well chosen. Why did you pick that way to walk to me? Are you walking backwards? I wouldn't mind it if you walked off the edge. One more? Oh, I almost had him. Okay, let's get this party on the road. I think I got it. Let's do this. <sighs> okay, let's get this bonfire, for God's sake. Come on. <laughs> I'm tired of dying. I'm tired of falling to my death. I'm okay with dying by enemies, but falling to your death is just a shitty way to go. There's also a lot of secrets on these things. There's many levels to them. Many bodies. Okay, let's try that again. There, I did it. Yay. Come on, it's a little bit too close. Could just equip my bow, but I really don't want to. Okay. I did it, I did it, yes. I don't know why I just jumped off. I could have just stayed on, I guess. Let's not fuck this up. Hmm. Roll or jump? Alright. Alright. Bonfire ahead. Oh, that sound. <gasps> that sound. The whoosh. Thank the gods. 
It is finally done. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to leave this episode there. It's a pretty good spot. I've actually made some progress. I don't want to end it on a sour note of falling down yet another couple dozen holes. So let's leave it there while I'm feeling good. Yeah. I'm definitely rusty, but... Um, I'm starting to get it back down. You know, the distance that I need to be for my halberd to hit just on the tip. The distance that you jump. Which is obviously further than I remembered it being. All those different things are... I'm starting to get them back down. Doing pretty good now. Alright, so I hope you've enjoyed so far. And I will be back soon and we will explore all of this.